trotting in the Hamiltonian. Looks like money trying to blast off on the far outside. There goes Jiggy Jog with early speed. The Philly Joviality from the inside with Fast as the Wind. It's Joviality, Fast as the Wind. A rebuff, the favorite cuts the corner now second. And fast as the wind, third, and swooping down, Temporo Hanover goes up to challenge for the lead as they head to the opening quarter. Then it's Jiggy Jog, fifth on the outside, and gaining track by King of the North, looking to go up there. Kegstand is wedged in early, followed by Cool Papa Bell, and looks like money, and the early trailer is Periculum. First quarter was pretty soft, 28 for Joe Viality, the filly, and Brian Sears setting up shop here at 5-2, to two, leading it by 2.5. And, and going after her now, here comes the favorite, Rebuff. Rebuff gets the cue from Tim Tietrich, and that one dashes up and takes over from Joe Viality. Temporal Hanover now back to third. Fast as the wind on the inside is fourth. Fast as the wind now in a two-path. Off stride goes Keg Stand, and he's off the course. King of the North gets underway fifth on the outside, tracked by Jiggy Jog. And then it's looks like money, stride for stride there with Cool Papa Bell, then Periculum, and Keg Stand, the uh, breaker, and also rough-gated King of the North. The half was 55 and three, the midway on the final turn. Rebuff is the target, it's Rebuff. Temporo Hanover on the outside coming at him. Joviality locked in the box third. Fast as the wind gap, the cover fourth. Cool Papa Bell needs racing room. Jiggy Jug comes three wide and they turn home. 124, they're in the stretch of the Hamiltonian. Rebuff trying to hold them off. Temporo Hanover on the outside pours it on. Here is Cool Papa Bell, Joe Vialdi on the inside, and Jiggy Jog in a wild finish here. Temporo Hanover, Cool Papa Bell, Joe Vialdi on the inside, Cool Papa Bell at 50 to 1. Pebble Beach is pulled away by the missile, showing some speed. He's going to take over second on the outside as they turn for home. Pebble Beach with the lead by the missile, closing second up the inside. Here comes Quick Snap, the outside Atlas Hanover, but Pebble Beach will take the second Adios elimination in a time of 150 and 150. The $500,000 Hambletonian Oaks, here they come. And the Phillies are off, off stride, Selfie Queen, way back, Selfie Queen on a break. Montcheval is up quickly, pink Coco Chanel on the outside. As Mano is put in play into the third position and swooping down with Fashion Schooner now third. Say so swing around that first turn. Bear My Soul settles in the fourth position now. Mano gets away in fifth. Venerable going up sixth, then comes Yanaba. Yanaba's followed by Baptism on a break when War Wizenia. War Wizenia way back after a first turn break. Selfie Queen broke before the start, the distant trailer. From post hand, Fashion Schooner made front here, six to one, 26 and one paid the price. Fashion Schooner and Tietrich leading the way across the backstretch. Mal Cheval second as they continue towards the half. Pink Coke Co Chanel right on the helmet in third. And it's Jingra with Bear My Soul, fourth on the inside. Venerable is gapped in fifth, followed by Manno, sixth on the inside. Then it's Yanaba who swings to the outside. And Baptism and the distant trailers are Selfie Queen and War Wizenia. 55 and 1, 29 second rating in that second quarter by Tietrich and Fashion Schooner onto the far turn. Fashion Schooner is the target. Mal Cheval, perfect two hole ride. Pink Coco Chanel on the inside, third. Bear My Soul edges to the outside, fourth. That's Venerable on the outside, fifth. Appears to be spinning her wheels at this point. Baptism to the inside, sixth. Mano has a long way to come. And then it's Yanaba and Fashion Schooner asserting herself and opening up here in 123 and one. They're in the stretch of the Hambletonian Oaks. And it's Fashion Schooner looking to go wire to wire. But now Pink Coco Chanel kicks in late into second. Far outside, Mano with late trot, Yanaba between horses. Fashion Schooner, home brave for the bionic man, Tim Tiedrich. Fashion Schooner in the Hamiltonian Oaks. They're into the stretch for the $300,000 Carl Milstein Memorial. They're off and uh, pacing and going out there. JK Victory looks for the lead. Nighthawk is along the inside second as they uh, roll on through the first turn. It is Sports Secret who's there in third. By the Missile is on the outside, currently trying to move up in fourth. Also there to the outside, Ponda Warrior. Then at the rail comes Heineken by the bay. Along the inside is soaring now the last two. Our please let me know in Leighton Hanover, the opening quarter, 26 
and two. So taking the lead is the favorite by the missile and Chris Page, who now front the field by a length and a half. Nighthawk is there in second. It's JK Victory in third. Up on the outside, fourth. Panda Warrior fifth at the rail is Sports Secret. They move down here to the half. Then on to the outside comes Soaring Now. Also up and at him is Please Let Me Know. Down to the inside, Heineken by the bay. The trailer, Leighton Hanover, the half in 54 and 1. On into that turn they go, and the Adios winner by the missile leads them. In their second, Nighthawk. On the outside, Ponda Warrior third. JK Victory is at the wood in fourth. On the outside, Soaring Now. Then at the rail is Sports Secret. Outside for Please Let Me Know with Heineken by the bay and Leighton Hanover to three quarters we go and so far the Ohio Brad has manhandled him here in 121 and four in and around the final turn with the lead by the missile by two and a half lengths in their second is Nighthawk on the inside is JK Victory third three wide is soaring now as they're at the top of the stretch in the Carl Milstein Memorial and it's by the missile who's by himself here by the missile ultra impressive Impressive tonight. 148 and 4. Each glass very comfortably out on top. Starts to step away from River Ness. Forever Boy on the outside closes third. Top of the stretch. They're on their way home. It's a strong beach class as he pleases. Forever Boy takes over second on the outside. Nautical Hanover with some late pace. But coming home, it's going to be beach class in the first Adios elimination. Close for second and 149 flat. They turn for home in the stretch. It's Joviality. Venerable looking for an upset on the outside and has dead aim. Joviality put to the test here. Joviality. Venerable. These two Phillies slug it out to the wire in a brilliant sprint. Joviality. Joviality. We're happy for Joviality. Test of faith unleashed on the outside. 120 and 3, 27 and 1 in the stretch drive. Test of faith takes the lead and glides clear out of the pocket. Racine Bell is full out. Amazing dream on the outside. All through is Grace Hill in deep stretch. Test of faith destroying them here in the Dorothy Houghton Memorial. It's Test of Faith. Amazing dream coming on for second. And then a photo 147 flat. 147 flat world record performance from Test of Faith. And they're off and trotting. Ikiri D loved by the masses. Out fast on the outside. Rattle my cage on the rail. Ambassador Hanover gets away in the top four. Uh, Raja one just eased away in the fifth position, followed by back of the neck, and it's academic. And the trailer is Quattro de Ulio. Broke before the start, got back trotting very quickly. Three wide sweep now from Loved by the Masses. Aggressive handling here from uh, Tim Tietrich. And Loved by the Masses clears the front end, leads it by a length and a quarter at the quarter in 27 and 2. So Rattle My Cage is the loose pocket sitter. E. Curie D is third by two. Ambassador Hanover fourth on the inside. Uh, Raja one bides his time fifth. Followed by back of the neck and it's academic and Quattro de Julio a long way from the lead. Single file and they follow loved by the masses. 14 to one long shot dictates the terms here. Rattle my cage now a bit tighter in second. E. Curie D is third at the half in a rate of 55 and 3, 28 one second quarter. Loved by the masses controls it to rattle my cage a two hole ride. E. Curie D on the inside third. Ambassador Hanover still fourth on the cones. Al Rajawan yet to get going. Now swings to the outside fed racetrack, but work to do. And then back of the neck on the inside. And he stride for stride with Quattro de Ulio and its academic trails. And three quarters loved by the masses looking to go coast to coast. Rattle my cage angles out. And Ikiri D, a late move on the outside and lurking is Al Rajawan. 123 and three into the stretch drive of the Cashman. And it's still loved by the masses, and they found out to come at him. Rattle my cage. Here's E. Curie D. Al Raja one on the outside, unleashed by Dexter Dunn. Al Raja one, a powerful sweep to the front and draws clear. Al Raja one, then E. Curie D. Then loved by the masses, and it's academic in 150 and three. 
Mares are off and trotting. Westland Quest is out fast. The next level stuff on the outside. And when Doves cries out sprinted. So Atlanta leaves alertly on the inside. She's cutting the corner and going for the lead for Yannick Jingra. It's the great Atlanta, the defending champion, takes the lead. So Westland Quest and Joe Bongiorno tucking in. When Doves cry going up fourth on the outside. Next level stuff yields uh, for fourth on the inside. Then two and a half lengths. Bella Bellini gapped early in fifth, followed by Kenzie Sky Hanover. Hot quarter here, 26 flat. And here comes When Doves Cry. Atlanta, When Doves Cry on the outside, an early grind parked out. Westland Quest in the pocket spot. Across the back stretch, next level stuff, uh, tracking in fourth position with Bella Bellini in fifth. And then it's Kenzie Sky Hanover sixth. And When Doves Cry finally does clear the lead. When Doves Cry from Atlanta back in second now as they pass the half. Westland Quest is third and next level stuff fourth. Bella Bellini fifth past the half and then Kenzie Sky Hanover. Half was solid here, 53 and three, 27 and three. When Doves Cry. Atlanta bump drafts the helmet as they round the turn. Westland Quest stays in. And now here comes Bella Bellini with her late bid. Fourth now, third and gaining quickly. Squeezing out of the pocket there was Atlanta very sharply. In front of Bella Bellini now second over. As they pass three quarters, Westland Quest gaps the pocket spot. Kenzie Sky Hanover has work to do. Then next level stuff and they turn for home. Three quarters, one, 22 and one. In the stretch coming after When Doves Cry. And here is Atlanta, Atlanta Deuce Pop and Bella Bellini on the outside. Three great mares are going at it here, but it's Bella Bellini prevailing. Bella Bellini drawing clear from When Doves Cry and Atlanta on the outside. Bella Bellini in even money, Dexter Dunn and Bella Bellini. Bella Bellini does it over When Doves Cry. And then it was Atlanta, and then it was close. Kenzie Sky Hanover or next level stuff. One, 49 and four fifths. Here they come. They are off in Dan Patch 29. Good start for working on a mystery at the inside and moving up quickly from the outside. This is the plan. Bulldog Hanover, the favorite, gets away in third. And then Little Rocket Man is next fourth, followed by Rocky Road Hanover, who has the fifth spot. Moving on to that first turn. A bucket bet Hanover from the second tier is now sixth. And then racing seventh is Tell Me About It. Break of two back of that to Backstreet Shadow. Racing in ninth is Fortify. Lose Perlman is 10th and last. The opening quarter was 26 seconds. Working on a mystery in front. Here comes Bulldog Hanover to the outside. And the favorite is now moving right alongside of Working on a Mystery. Racing along in third is This Is The Plan as the field approaches the half-mile pole. Passing the half in 54-3, and 28-3 and three was the second quarter. And Bulldog Hanover now leads the way onto the far turn. Bulldog Hanover in front by a length and a half very quickly. Working on a mystery is second. This is the plan is next. Then Little Rocket Man. Rocky Road Hanover advancing up on the outside of that. Also moving up second over is Tell Me About It. To the inside of Buck Abet Hanover as the field comes to the top of the stretch. Three quarters of a mile, 122 and three. Bulldog Hanover comes off the turn with the lead. Working on a mystery to the inside. Rocky Road Hanover is there on the outside. Also trying to come on wide is Backstreet Shadow. Bulldog Hanover leads into the final eighth of a mile. Has it by two lengths. It's Bulldog Hanover. Bulldog Hanover has won the 29th. Dan Patch stakes the time, 148 and one. Second was Rocky Road Hanover, then working on a mystery, and this is the plan.